We're going live on five, four, three, two, one. Good evening. I'm Jordan and I'm Maggie. It's Friday, December twenty fourth, two thousand nineteen, and this is the Goat in Garrettsville, Ohio, reporting on a special news story. We are interviewing Luke, and today he's going to be telling us facts about goats. How long ago were goats discovered? They were discovered 10,000 years ago. Wow, that's a long time ago. What do you make with goat milk? I make, make many products with goat milk, including fudge, butter, ice cream, yogurt, and cheese. I did not know that you can make ice cream and fudge. How, how much do goats weigh? About 150 pounds, and they gain one pound a day, surprisingly. Wow, that's a lot. But what do they look like? They have legs, hip, horns, fur, fur all over. Just like a, 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 just like a dog, like, just like a dog, dogs that have fur and legs. Where do your ghosts live? The goats need to live in a barn so they can stay warm and safe. Just like our homes, warm and safe. So what do you feed your goats? My goats like to eat corn, hay, oats, and other food, but they really enjoy eating thorns and brush. Ew, thorns. That would hurt my mouth. What type of goats do you raise? I raise La Macha and the Nubian goats. I can tell them apart because because Nubian goats have ears, and Nubian goats have practically no ears. I need to know, do goats really have four stomachs? It's so weird, but yes, goats really do have four stomachs. They swallow food whole, and the food turns into into cud and they swallow it again and cud again and digest into the third stomach and fourth stomach. How can you make money off your goats? We make many things out of goat milk like ice cream, yogurt, and other products. Really? That seems like a lot of products. What else can you do with their goat milk? You can make butter, cheese, and fudge. Does that sound delicious? Oh, cool. That sounds good, but I'm a vegetarian. Well, do you make things out of their fur? Well, we make yarn, scarves, coats, clothing, also floor rugs, carpets, and doll hair. Wow, I have a lot of those. I thought that was made out of sheep hair. How much hair does goats have? Two inches of hair to protect them from the sun. Oh, and hey, what do they eat? Well, they eat some interesting things like brush and thorns. Ouch! That would hurt my gums badly. Is it true that some goats almost have no ears? Yes, that's true. But there is only one type of one type that have no ears, which is the long matcha goats. Oh, I did not know that there was only one kind of goat that had almost, almost had have no ears. Do goats have teeth? Yes, they do, but they, they don't have front teeth. Well, I don't use my front teeth often, but mostly to smile. What do you call the stuff that they swallow in their third and fourth stomachs? It's called cud. Gross, right? Do you know a story about goats? Yes. yes uh, I've heard of one in Greek mythology. There is a satyr, half man, half goat. Oh, that's... Oh, that's really cool. Do you know a movie with them? Yes. Toy Story 4, there's a, a three-headed glass goat. That's really cool. What, what can you do with goats? You can do... Goat yoga? I've never tried it, but I've seen it. I never knew that goats do yoga. What else is there about goats? There's a lot of goats at 
County Fairs and at the Petting Zoo. Now we are going to show you a quick video. Some new episodes. Maybe something quantum. Airplanes? How do they fly? It's magic, right? Yogurt or yoga? Segways? Who made them? Can we get rid of them all? Hopefully. How about bicycles? I think bicycles are good. Tricycles? Who invented the bike? Cartoons are big. The physics of cartoons? Why doesn't he fall down? <laughs> Rambunctious and playful and hilarious and cute, but what is going on with their eyes? They're part Kermit the Frog, part squid, part I don't even know. Like most other ungulates, goats have horizontal rectangular pupils. Along with their eyes being on the side of their head, those slits let like goats make out detail and depth perception nearly 360 degrees around their whole body. Now this makes sense if you spend most of your life out in the open exposed to predators, but there's a trade-off to horizontal pupils. They can't see well on the vertical axis, so if you're gonna sneak up on a goat, do it from above. <laughs> Goats, what's up with the fainting? Sure, it's cute, makes a good YouTube video. That is not how you go. <laughs> fainting goats aren't actually fainting. They remain conscious the whole time. But thanks to a hereditary genetic disorder, their muscles fail to relax after contracting thanks to this mutation in a muscle chloride channel. This condition, also seen in some humans, and cats, and dogs, is set off when they're panicked or scared. So, stop sneaking up on goats already. <laughs> Or don't. It's actually kind of adorable. Goats love standing on stuff. Anything. Sheet metal, cows, trampolines, pigs. Basically, if it's a thing, a goat will stand on it. They develop their climbing ability because of their previous mentioned inability to see above or below. But it's also to gain access to food that's out of the reach of other grazers and to avoid predators because it's pretty hard to attack a goat on a completely vertical wall. Goats get their awesome climbing skills thanks to their special two-toed hooves. The pads of these hooves are soft and grippy, and they can spread out to sort of disperse the goat's weight on a variety of surfaces. Their ninja-like ability makes sense, since domestic goats were descended from the mountain goats of Zagros, which sounds like a metal band from Game of Thrones. <laughs> Goats can make a wide variety of noises, but there's no evidence they can, that they can actually mimic human speech. Rather, our brains are just so fine-tuned to pick out language that we can't help but hear words in their maniacal screams. <laughs> Researchers at Queen Mary University in London did report that, that goats can develop certain accents in their voices if they move to a different goat group. In terms of adaptable animal voices, this puts them in the select company of humans, dolphins, elephants, and Madonna. That time she moved to England. They say goats will eat anything. Now, while they probably wouldn't go jumping on explosives, goats are browsing herbivores, meaning that they are curious eaters who taste pretty much anything that resembles plant matter. Goats actually have nearly twice the taste buds that we do, but seem to have a high tolerance for bitter, sometimes toxic plants. They'll eat cotton clothing, or even paper. Hey, Joe. Joe, you fell asleep. Joe, are you okay? Whoa. I just had the weirdest dream. We did an entire episode about goats. Was that any good? It was bad. <laughs>